Hey, welcome to my video on uploading a, no, a file via Node.js to a server, uh, to an S3 bucket via a server. Sorry, that was like kind of a stumble there. But um, today I'm going to show you how to upload to S3. Um, so if you take a look at my screen, I have this repository here. I've included a link down in the description that I've, I've been using all my videos on. I have lots of videos on S3, so just take a look at my channel. Um, while you're there, please subscribe. These screenshots just go show goes through and shows you how to do it with Python, how to do a file upload using Python. But now we're gonna do it with with uh, Node. Excuse me. Okay, so we have these three constants. I should actually start by doing this. You're gonna need the Amazon SDK. It's provided by Amazon. So do an npm install AWS SDK. If you want to get to where I am, download the Mern boilerplate. Follow the file upload video and then return here. So just pause the video here and then come back. I'm just gonna do an npm install AWS SDK dash dash save. And then I'm gonna copy this, not into the readme, because it needed to be in the, I'm gonna copy these three elements, which are all constant and should be kept secret. And I'm gonna copy this. Add it in right here. Um, I think I left this in here because I didn't actually. I don't think it actually belongs in there, but I just left it in there. And this will actually never return anything, but it will return. So, uh, so the file has a, uh, as you can see from my previous one, it has a name, which will be our key, and then the data goes right into the body. And then we'll be over. It's it's done. It's uploaded. So, I mean, that's all it takes. And then we have the proper things installed. Okay. Um, the last thing is to just add the uh, programming access keys and the bucket name. Uh, this is the I am user key. This is the secret. And the bucket name is node end to end, and it is in the URL. So our first thing is just going to be getting a file up there. And if I can open up the right thing, uh, and then I'm going to run npm run start dev, which runs the server. In my previous file upload, I have this all set up here where it has passes an example text. I'm not actually doing anything with the example one. I also have the image being passed in and it's going to API upload there. And I hit send. I have no idea how this is going to turn out. It actually will never have a response. I did not include a response, which is not good. You should probably include one. Okay, so that. The files uploaded, upload finished. It's probably just a little delay. And there's my image. It's 5.3 megabytes. Download. I have no idea what this image is. I think it's for my trip. I can click open when it's done. And there's the image. So it's successfully uploaded. That's how you do file upload with Amazon S3. If you like this video, please subscribe. Uh, please check out my end-to-end -end tutorial as well.